What's up guys? In this video we are going to be connecting to an Eaton power meter. Uh, this is one of the power expert meters and we're going to be going into the web portal that they have in these meters trying to get some information out of it and I'm going to show you a little bit about how to set one of these up to communicate on a LAN connection. Uh, for right now I'm going to turn you around just to show you this meter. Okay, you can see the meter here, it is cycling through and of course one of the things that you need to know is what the IP address for the meter is and of course unless it has been uh, changed from the default but either way what you can do is you can press the menu button on this meter and you basically will cycle through once I press the menu button I'm going to scroll down to where it says IP. Once that is flashing, I scroll down and then I come over to where it says enter and I press the enter button. And once I press the enter button, that tells me the default IP address that is in this meter. And then from there, what I've got to do is I've got to go into my network settings on my computer. And I've already done this on mine, but I wanted to show it for you guys. And I've got to go in and change the information here. Basically I'm going to click into this, I'm going to go into the properties, I've got to change my network adapter settings and what I'm looking for is the TCP IP4. Double click into that, set your uh, address, the IP address for your machine, uh, like one value off. You know you want to have it within the same range and then once you do that close everything out and once you get everything closed out you will just take that IP address open up a browser and then enter that IP address here okay 192 just bear with me guys I got cables and everything laying around right there is my IP address so I press enter it's going to bring me to my window the default password and username for this meter is admin admin and I highly recommend that you change it on this meter once you log in. It's going to prompt you to change your password and you need to go ahead and do that. Okay we have our username and password entered. I'm going to hit log in. Of course I've got touch screen so I'm going to use that and this is my meter data. I am live in with my meter and from here to change your settings as you will go up to the settings tab you can go in here and select comms and inside comms is where you're going to set all of your information as far as your instance ID your uh, IP address and that sort of thing but guys this is just a quick video that I wanted to do to show you all how to access these uh, this is kind of an on-the-fly thing so I'd appreciate it if you had any questions leave those down in the comments below be sure to check out the rest of the videos on my channel be sure to subscribe thanks for watching and we'll see you next time